Hi everybody, welcome back to The Young Grower. So in this video, we're gonna be starting off our sweet potato slips in some water. Mine have just arrived today and I ordered them from Highland Horticulture. The first year I grew sweet potatoes, I ordered them from here. Then last year I grew them from the sweet potatoes I grew, but I forgot to start some off and I decided let's just order some again. I've bought these myself. They were 10 pound for five slips. And we've got three different varieties. We've got Beauregard, what I've grew before, that I love, really big. Carolina Ruby, that I've grew before as well, and I've had some really big ones. But this one here is a new one for me, Moloke Purple. And it's a beautiful purple sweet potato. As soon as I saw it, I said, oh, I need to try that. That one was a little bit more expensive. It was five slips for 12 pound. And they've just arrived now. And if you wanna get some ordered, there should be still plenty of time to get some. To start off with, we need to unpack them. And we have some jars here that we're gonna place them in with some water and that is gonna make them root. And we also have some ochre tubers, what I had to get. So let's get these out of the plastic and put them in these jars. So on these ones, you can see it's already got roots. So what we're gonna do, place them in the jar and then we're gonna fill the water up. And some labels up already, just so we don't forget which ones are which and get them mixed up. They do look a little sad at first, but I wouldn't worry too much. They will come back. Previously, they've come back really well, and you'll see that for yourself very soon. This is the final bunch, and that's the Bureau Guard. And so I don't end up destroying the roots when I take the elastic band off, I'm just gonna cut it and undo it that way. Now we just need to fill these jars up with some water. And there we go. I'm just gonna put these on the draining board for tonight and hopefully they should all come back to life and there'll be no more droopy leaves. Before we finish up, let's quickly have a look at these ochre, I think they're pronounced. Wow. They look amazing. I've never grew these before. I've never eaten them before, but I thought, why not? Let's try them. Let's see what happens. Anyway, we'll catch up tomorrow and see how they're getting on. So somehow I forgot to film the ending to this video, but the sweet potatoes did really well. I put them in the water and you can see they bounced right back. I'm gonna get ready to plant these very soon. So keep an eye out for that video. But if you would like some inspiration and information, go back and watch my videos from the previous years and there'll be some tips and some stuff there for you to learn. Thank you all for watching and we'll see each other soon.